yeah, innovation. <coughs> okay, so IBM says think big. Everybody is saying think big, think big, think big. The big idea. And mm -hmm. I'm just think differently. You really don't have to think big, really. Because if you think big, then, you know, you probably just be thinking forever. Just <laughs> think differently. Oh. And, and that's innovation. The moment you can think differently and you can have a niche for yourself, that's innovation. You know, I uh, wanted, wanted to buy a white marker board in my office. Do you guys think that if you had, what would you prefer? A white marker board and a wall that you can write on and you can mm -hmm. raise it. Oh, it's a the wall. No, actually, I'll um, set the wall. And that's because I'm saying if you, want, if you really have to write anyway, because then you want to write or not. So if you want to write, you actually prefer the wall because it gives you more space. It's, it's like it's not limited. And that's, that's very innovative for me, you know. And do you know how expensive that paint is? And I want to write paint. It's in every single wall in my office. Every single, every, every single office in my in my wall. my company has this wall. <laughs> 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 Every wall in my office, yeah. whatever. We get it. Yeah. Okay, so it's all about and brand innovation is driven by vision, passion, culture and leadership. Now why you why you why you innovate it? Because you want to be a leader of some sort that last time in that space. Right? And, no. and it's also the culture of the people because what applies in Nigeria will not apply in Togo as close as Togo and Nigeria is because the culture of the people are actually very different. So you want to keep the culture in mind. And um, I also, and you know, and basically you don't have to create a new product really. You really don't have to start thinking about what, the, what, what you're creating. You can just change the design. And there's something that, um, Franklin said it because I really, really, I really, really like about this line. When he spoke about um, the colorful extinguisher, I thought it was very amazing. Mm. And you know, instead of having the red, which connotes fire, and then they're seeing this guy is very scary. <laughs> because when you see it, it's probably more past it when it went red already, you know. And you know, <laughs> and, you know the, 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 the manufacturer now.